Okay, let's talk about the day 21 exercise. And I hope this exercise is a little bit smaller than most of the exercises. Uh, understand it's the end of this semester and you really got a lot of things to do. Okay, so let's take a look on the first one. So let me change my name here. Yang Song. And then the first question is, you are going to receive a tuple. And then for a tuple, you, you receive, and then you want to keep the first item, the last item, and then for the middle item, it should be your own name. So you are required to assemble a new tuple based on the input one. The rule is you keep the first, you keep the last, and in the middle, you just plug in your name. So uh, how can this be done? Mm, well, if we do the tuple input square bracket zero, what is that? That is the first value of the input tuple, okay? So we want to keep that. And how about the tuple input visit negative one? That is the last item of the input tuple. So the problem is how do we put this one and your name? Say, well, uh, my name is Yang, but feel free to change it to your name. And then uh, the last item of the tuple. So I want to put them together into a new tuple, right? So I can say new tuple equals. Okay, so is this, is this good? Is this correct? Let me run this. Okay. Uh, let me see. So it is the something wrong with the int and string. Okay, so there are some incompatible data types. Okay, it's this one. So, well, we are, we are sending a tuple as a bunch of the values. And then for this one, this is one item. But what is the type of this item? If we are using this one, as the input. So let me copy it here. No worries, you can get it fixed. So this will be the first item. So this will be a zero. So we are grabbing the first item, which is a zero. And then we are adding a string. And then what is this one? This is the, the last one will be the 90, 99.3. So we are adding an integer, a string, and a flow number. No, it can't work. What are what is our goal? We are putting together a tuple, right? So how about I do this way? I do the tuple input with the square bracket uh, with the, with the index zero. That is first item, and then young, the second item, and comma tuple input negative one. That is the last item, and then I want to do a return new. Tuple. Okay, so let's see this way and see if it works. Okay, so the first one is hello, who is making changes? So hello, Yang is making changes. So Yang is in the middle, that's good. And for the second one, and we have the zero, the first item in 99.3, the last item, and then Yang is in the middle. Okay, so that is correct. Okay, well, let me also talk about the second one. The second one is going to be the hardest one. Well, you are going to receive a really huge tuple. Well, let me again copy the, the test case. Say, ah, uh, I want, I, I like the Michael Jackson one better. So, uh, come on, come on. Uh, come on, can I copy that? Okay, here we go. I want to copy this tuple. Well, this is a long tuple, and we can see the first item should be the artist name. So the artist name, and then the album name, and then the year. And after that, what do we have? We have a bunch of the nested tuples, the tuples inside the tuples, okay? so. And then we can have multiple of them. And for each of the track as a sub tuple, we have the name of this track, and then we have the length of the track. 
Okay, and then we want to unpack this tuple, and this is what we are gonna have. We are gonna print this information. The album name is the album of the artist name released in that year, and then we then we are gonna go ahead and do a track listing. Okay, so. Let, let's answer the first question. How can we have this tuple unpacked? So this is called tuple param. Let me just take this one, tuple param, and then let's try to separate the tuple param into the name, comma, title, comma, year, comma, tracks, equals tuple param. Okay, so we are breaking the tuple prime into four pieces. Okay, the name of the artist, the title, the year, and then the remaining tracks as a sequence of tuples. Okay, so well, let's let me try and see if it works. I'm going to print name, comma, title, comma, year, and then I also want to print the tracks. Okay, so let me just do those printing and see if I can unpack this tuple correctly because I don't know. Okay, when I run this, oh, I got an arrow. This means, well, for the name, title, and year, and track, I'm suggesting or I'm expecting only four items to be unpacked but that's not the case because we have the name and the title and the year and then we have a bunch of the remaining sub as uh, the sub tuples so we can't really unpack this way so let me try another way then okay how about I want to do like this so for the name, title, and year, and I know they are the index zero and comma, index one and index two. So let me do this, okay? So index one and index two. So I want to unpack the name, title, and the year first, and they are the first three, first three items. And then for the tracks, I want to do another way, which is the tuple, param, and then I'm going to start from the zero, one, two, zero, one, two, three so starting from the index three okay so this is well for the first I first three items i'm gonna assign them to name title and year and then for the tracks i'm creating a slice a slice of this tuple i'm keeping from the index three all the way to the end okay so let me run this code oh i should print those values Okay, so print and then name, title, and year. And I also want to print the tracks and see what I got. Okay, so let's run this. Okay, so well, the name, the track, and then the year, and then a bunch of the sub tuples as a tuple. Okay, and then, uh, well, the, the second one will be for Adele. Okay, well, I'm not worrying about that. Okay, so the next part, I want to do a iteration so that I can break up the name of the track and then the length of the track. Okay, so let's see how I can do that. So how about I do a iteration like for sub tuple in tracks. And then if I'm doing this, and then say if I want to print sub tuple, and then I might still on the right track because I want to visit all the all the sub tuples in the track. So let me run this. Okay, so I got the artist name, title, and the year, and then I'm visiting each of the sub tuples. So I'm getting there. Remember, I want to uh, format a output like this, but well by by Unpack, unpacking this tuple and then doing the iteration on the sub tuples, I'm getting there. Okay, so well, I want to stop here because I'm, uh, I'm, if I'm continue, I'm giving the full solution. So I want to stop here. So you have to figure out how you can unpack this sub tuple so you so that you get the name of the track and then the length of the track, and so eventually you want to 
print you want to format this output okay so i want to stop here and hope this video can help you and uh, i'm going to continue doing that for uh, the rest a couple of the exercises and plus for the project four which is a warm-up for the coding final so good luck